number three, creatine helps your bones. Apparently, if you supplement with creatine for a long time, it's going to help your bone density. Now, I will say this out loud, but I don't really know what it means. But creatine monohydrate supplementation can increase the phosphocreatine creatine ratio in skeletal muscle tissue. Or basically, because you are improving your strength and because you are improving your fitness palace of love stuff and because you are improving your brain, your bones go, well, I want to be left out. Maybe I should get stronger too. However, just to give you parity, there are other studies that say if you're an older human being and your bones have already gone through some damage, this may not actually do any good at all. So I suppose you could say the earlier you start supplementing with creatine the better however once again i would have a 180 for you because you do not need to add all the supplements in the world when you first start training see how your body reacts to it and make sure that you're kicking ass in the gym and then yeah when you get to your first plateau add in a supplement when you get to your second plateau add a supplement but given that i would always put creatine number one on that list and so you may start with it young i know that i certainly did maybe your bone health will be better my bones are pretty good maybe that's why